and food line. We're back now with the influencer known as the sassy trucker. She's back home after months stuck in Dubai. And Maria Virial has her story. Good morning, Maria. Hey, good morning, Michael. If you can believe it, this all started with a fender bender in Dubai, but it escalated quickly. And at one point, the sassy trucker and her family both thought she might end up in jail or even prison. This morning, relief and elation from Tierra Allen, a social media influencer known to her fans as the sassy trucker. I was also told I might be the first female truck driver to ever drive a truck in Dubai. It was very scary for me because I didn't know at times if I was going to face jail time or go to prison. Now back home in Houston. Welcome home. <laughs> and speaking out after being held in Dubai for months. They just stripped me of my passport. I couldn't go anywhere. The 29-year-old with a fan base of more than 180,000 TikTok followers documenting her life as a trucker and showing her travels across the world. I am here in Dubai about to test drive this truck. She says she was banned from leaving the United Arab Emirates following a dispute at a rental car agency after an accident while on vacation in May. The car allegedly impounded with her passport and credit cards inside. When she went to retrieve her belongings, she says she was told to pay a fee. From there, things kind of just transpired into something really big that wasn't expected. She tells us things escalated between her and an employee at the rental car company. He followed me outside and told me he was calling the cops on me for shouting at him. And I said, okay, you can call the cops. Days later, she says she was arrested and held in jail for one day for shouting at the employee, which the UAE has strict rules against. I was shocked. I was nervous. I was scared. I didn't know what to do. The influencer spending the next three months in a hotel while her family and Congresswoman Sheila Jackson Lee worked to help clear the travel ban. The State Department is used to be able to help Americans make their way through these different rules. But as a woman, she was treated differently. Tierra's mom ultimately paying $1,360 to get her daughter's passport back. I felt like there was hope, finally, that my daughter would return home. It feels absolutely amazing. I enjoy the freedom. I appreciate all the hard work everyone's done for me, and I'm very excited to be back in the USA. The Dubai police did release a statement saying, in part, they received a complaint from a rental car company about Miss Ann, Miss Allen slandering and defaming one of their employees, but she was subsequently released pending legal proceedings between her and that company. The good news is, guys, right now, neither the State Department nor Miss Allen, the sassy trucker, or her family believe that there are any pending criminal charges so far. All guys? right. Thank you, Moran. I know she's happy to be home. Mm -hmm. All right, coming up. The woman who was abandoned as a newborn reunited with the nurse who found her. And that's just the beginning of...